Okay, so before we start today's episode, we wanna take the time out to remind everyone that at Lush Talk, we encourage safe drinking. While we're having fun, it's also important to be responsible and not put others in danger. So make sure you are settled in like we are and drinking responsibly. With that said, let's lush on together. We're back. We are back for more Football Sunday. Fun. Ready for Super Bowl Sunday. Okay, listen. Okay. Oh, she ready. Where are your shoulder pads at? I'm John Madden. Get ready for some football. Well, she ready. She ready. I'm ready. So listen, okay. You're about to put on a party and whatnot, and you don't have time to be doing individual drinks. Anybody has time for that? Anybody has time for that. So we are gonna do the pineapple party punch, which means your punch is about to be ready. It's, it's a big batch cocktail, and everybody pour their own glass and YOLO, okay, after that. Easy, easy peasy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And I think I have very high hopes for this, yes. okay? Oh, and this, we're gonna put this down at the uh, oh, in yes. description. We got yes. this off of Amazon. So you'll definitely be able to get your picture going. Exactly, yeah. So let's run through what you need to make this and then we're gonna assemble. Mm -hmm. So you need some pineapple chunks, okay? Frozen. Frozen, nice and cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're gonna need some white Bacardi, well, sorry, some white rum. So again, you can use whatever rum you wanna use. We're using Bacardi here. Yeah. You gonna need you one bottle of either champagne or Prosecco. Mm hmm Okay. And four cups of pineapple juice. Mm. And this is gonna be our ice. That's gonna keep everything chilled, okay? Mm -hmm. So, let's go ahead and assemble. So I'm gonna start with our pineapple chunks. Yes, ma'am. In theory. Open this, please. <laughs> Ciao. I should open it before. You see what happens when you don't open things before. Oh, I opened this one and not the other one. You didn't open up enough. <sighs> the failure. I'm just trying to not spill, so I'm gonna get this all in here. That's still not opening. I did. No, I, I, do I need it? I just want to make sure what you're doing. Oh no, it's 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 coming. It's just getting there. It's open. I'm just trying to not spill it out. And this is why you make table. batch drinks and not make multiple. Like, cause anybody got time for that? I got bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that. Really? With the time? With the why? I was just trying to see what time it was. No, I want to make sure that I'm not missing a game. We're doing this. We're doing this well in advance. Okay. I guess I'll start with my pineapple juice. Mm-hmm. What do you call pineapple? Oh yeah. That's that good stuff. All right. I'm gonna do that last. The bubbly. We'll do our half a cup of rum. Half. It says half. Go ahead. Okay, I mean, you, you look disapprovingly, so that I didn't know. Be more than that, but whatever. I like it. I like the way. So I guess, I mean, you could do whatever the ancestors tell you to do. Could. You know? So if you go, want some go, more. Yeah, go ahead you, and put some more in it. Go ahead, you go ahead. You, go ahead. You, you, you part of this team too? It's part of your punch too? It's football Sunday. So now I'm deaf in this ear. Congratulations to me. Um, and we're gonna pour our bottle of Prosecco in here. Oh my God. We're both watching this really anxiously, like, what's gonna happen now? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna stir this before putting the mm -mm, middle mm -mm. insert in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this 
was good. I'm not gonna hold Fourth you. Fourth down, are we gonna make a touchdown or a field goal or nothing? I hope it's a touchdown. It's gonna make it. Is it? Yeah. Do we think so? Yeah. Our old picture would never. Oh, if you saw any of those episodes, like the sangria episodes, oh. Woo, the struggle. Okay. Bring that to the How are we gonna pour this? You're gonna move. Okay, good. Because. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'll let you go first. Oh! She said, "I have somebody has to protect the floor." Thank you. All right, we'll turn this a little bit. Okay. It looks promising, y'all. It smells good. Mm-hmm. Okay, and then I'll do my turn oh. here, so you can do your little thing. Ooh, chill. Nice little contraption. Okay. I just want to apologize in advance. If you decide that you got to go take a nap, my ancestors were speaking to me. My bad. We'll just leave that right there. Okay. Oh, oh, see, I poured me a sample. She's, she poured her a sample. I'm ready. <sighs> Cheers. Ooh, baby, baby. Hey, baby, thank you. Hey! Get on the dance floor. Mm. Okay, so your turn. <laughs> Come on. Mm. I like this. This is giving me Super Bowl vibes, Sunday party vibes. Game day, baby. Anyway, I like this. This is a 10, this is a 10. This is definitely something needed for the parties. And listen, you can have a couple of these lined up. Mm -hmm. Ain't gotta worry about changing these things out for a minute. But then again, these are good. So people might be coming back for more. Um, just make sure you don't go heavy handed on it because your guests will spend the night at your house. Just yeah, you know we, we're not responsible for that part. No, we're not responsible mm -hmm. for that part. The other thing I like about this, it had the separate ice um, container, which mm -hmm. does not water down your beverage. That is key. No. Keep it chilled without watering it down. That is key. Yes. So like you, this is clearly a 10. I'm, when we cut off camera, I'm going to be dumpster diving for, not actually dumpster diving, but I'm going to dive for the, the pineapples, mm -hmm. okay? Because they've been marinating a little bit. Yeah, yeah, but not with my hand because that's nasty, but like, I'm gonna get a spoon. Um, but get into this and listen, You like you said, you could have multiple different ones. Mm -hmm. uh, like you could have different punches, but yeah. like in these particular containers and everybody can serve themselves and you can worry worried about the food and other, and other aspects of your party. Mm -hmm. So this is definitely in terms of entertaining, like this particular, uh, contraption, wonderful, and the actual beverage itself, like I said, a 10. Um, it's not too mm. pineapple-y, like it mm -hmm. gives you the right amount of pineapple with the right amount of liquor yes, and your Prosecco. I also think that if it just happens to not be football Sunday and it happens to be brunch at your house, this is also That's a also great good. brunch alternative. So it's a really versatile and not to be cocktail. Brilliant. I mean, look, we barely cracked the bottle. I mean, I'm probably, I'm like you, I probably would put a little more rum in there. The recipe called for half a cup. It probably should have been like a whole cup. Probably one half. Or more. Yeah, but <laughs> I mean, look, a couple bottles of that, this, you have a whole party. Right. I'm just saying. Exactly. Inexpensive. Inexpensive. Exactly. But like she said, know your guests because they could end up spending the night at your place. Mm -hmm. um, so just be aware of that, yep. you know? Uh, just monitor yourself, monitor yourself, but enjoy, yeah, enjoy. So listen, um, you guys have to try this out. Let us know what you think about it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and ring that bell, okay? Because uh, it's football Sunday and it's finna get lit, okay? Tell us what other Super Bowl cocktails are on your menu. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what else you got to say? Like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know what you think. Uh -huh. And send us pictures and stuff like that. Oh, I mean, yeah. We want to see what you're making. 
Listen. Right. Okay, don't just be saying you try something. Right. Prove it. Because <laughs> I don't believe you. Right. Yo. Picture or no. Picture or no. Okay. See y'all later. We'll be back. <laughs>